how dangerous is ai it becomes very important to discuss this and understand this as an ai practitioner our job does not end in making some good fruitful products helping businesses grow and make some money no our responsibility is also there to educate people around us how ai can harm them and that is the theme of this video the reason i am creating this video is i saw a very good 45 minute speech on how destructive ai can be i am going to give you that speech link of that towards end of this video before that let's discuss some important aspects of what are the things we should be mindful about okay so before moving on further guys let me ask you if you have read the book called sapiens a brief history of mankind by yuval noah harari if not this is a must to read book guys because it will challenge the way you think about the existence it will challenge the belief system and that is one great way of learning new things having said that let's discuss few things about how humans learn over the years or how humans have evolved over the years so you know what is good and what is bad from where you have a bias or you have a opinion about few things from where you have understood this is the way life should be and this is the way life should not be from where we have our constitution written in languages right we have our moral values that is stored in our brain right and we have a system in which we live that we have learned from previous generation experiences some books some great people said something our families and you know all the elders said you should do this you should not do this right and that is how we know this is how we should live this is how we should not live murder is a bad thing we should not do that nobody should do a murder right so we know that from from all the learnings that has happened in the mankind so far what if all these learnings are artificial think on this for a moment guys what if the learnings that i feed to you is artificial what is the example of that suppose um in facebook this this comes from a very nice discussion with one of my friend okay so in facebook suppose i search for something which is unrealistic okay suppose i search for something which is unrealistic for example a fish flying in the air okay a fish flying in the parallel of a aeroplane something like that if i search on the youtube or facebook content like this right you will see that though it's not real though it's not it cannot happen youtube or facebook will start recommending you all those non real kind of videos which which you know talks about this why this is happening because at the most basic form ai understands that this is what you want to see this is what you want to see ai understands and it starts showing you that it may be it may be a fake it may be a fake thumbnail it, it can be a clickbait or whatever that's not the discussion but the discussion is whatever you want to search or whatever you want to see more these platforms will show you more of that okay and that is where opinions are built and that is where biases are built and that is where logical thinking goes for a toss so the job of these platforms are not to educate you the job of these platforms are not to make you a good human being the job of these platforms are to hold yourself in that platform as long as they can okay so you and me have to be really careful and make our nears and dear ones careful about what is being thrown at them okay and in the first time of history of ai now there can be knowledge is which is not real and that is artificial suppose to a ai system i tell that give me a story about how fish is flying in parallel with aeroplane that maybe it can give me a story like that okay if you want to create a video of aman dancing bhangra maybe aman never danced on bhangra but a ai deep fake can create a video where aman is dancing on bhangra right so what i am saying here is languages can be created uh, the speeches can be created the articles can be created the videos can be created the images can be created all fake nothing real and 
these can be bombarded to you to form a opinion to change your opinion to create biases in the society and when that happens that's a very very dangerous scenario so suppose you are scrolling your facebook you see some news and then you form an opinion but that news is not real at all there is a video you see that and then you form an opinion that video is not real at all and what if think for a moment how a political leader convinces you to vote for them because they say something and you think okay this guy is saying so this is right what if this can be automated billions of those videos i can create and i can keep sending to you i can keep sending to you then where will our intelligence go and where will our opinions go and what will happen to the elections what will happen to the people's judgment what will happens to the people way of looking at things right so nobody comes nobody need to come and you know fit a chip in your mind they just need to create content that you want to watch little they will put flavor of little bias in that and you know they are successful in what they want to do so what we have to do as an ai practitioner few things we must keep in mind guys first is what what is that you are working for so every time you are working on a ai initiative ai project ai product see what is the intention here okay and don't contribute in something which is not you know intended for right things second is educate your family and friends that everything they are going to see suppose next year there is election in india in us both 2024 right whatever is coming on the social media not everything is real so some videos can be fake some articles can be fake some images can be fake educate people around you that these can be fake ai is capable of doing these things okay and third whenever you are working in some ai use cases ai products you know be in a mindset of telling to people the difference between ai and real so for example if i am interacting with chatbot then i should know i am interacting with a artificial thing i am not interacting with the real human so everybody should come close to real human in terms of exchanging their ideas and thoughts so if you are exchanging ideas and thoughts with me that's perfectly fine no problem with that you can agree or disagree with my idea and my thoughts but you know you should not do the same thing with a machine because that does not make any sense machine can defeat you based on how that machine has been learned right it can defeat you so there is no purpose in that so be very very careful on where you are putting your energy in as well and then i'm going to leave you with one 45 minutes speech of yuval noah harari which you must watch and a big credit to yuval noah harari for that speech that gave me motivation to create this video to all my uh, ai enthusiasts guys let's be very very careful on what are we doing why are we doing and let's keep educating our family friends and everybody we can about how destructive ai can be obviously there are many positive things ai can do but everybody should be aware of how destructive it can be please drop me a comment how did you like this video and what are your opinions on that i'll see you in the next video wherever you are stay safe and take care